So this is part two of my studio tour, and this is the cutting section. So this is my horizontal bandsaw. It's a LS 1600. Oh boy, this is a good, good time saver. <laughs> and this is my Evo chop saw. And I've got a little roller table built. So all my stock can come in from outside right through the door behind me, just right up onto the table. And if I'm cutting smaller diameter stuff that I don't want to try to run through the chop saw or bigger plate, a longer, wider plate that won't fit in the chop saw, then I've got a shear and it just lines up right there. I can even use the, uh, the uh, backstop on the chop saw. Lines up close enough that I can use it as a backstop when I'm trying to cut something with my plate shear. And this is my 10 Smith jump shear. And they call it a jump shear or sometimes a foot shear because You either have to jump on that pedal or that's where you put your feet to work the pedal to make everything work. Depending on how thick your metal is, how worn out your blades are. You know, this is rated to 16 gauge, no thicker. Another real handy little shear that I have here is this Beverly, it's a number two shear. And this is great because this is called a throatless shear. So you can cut curves with it. You can cut circles on it both inside and outside. So you can just continue right on around. You know, if you want to trace out a circle, trace out some odd little shape pattern, boy, just like a big pair of scissors, really. And you can just sit there and just kind of work it through, work it around. It does a really, really nice job. Um, this one's rated to 16 gauge. Now the Beverly 3, the next size up, it's actually rated to eighth inch. Yeah, yeah, someday. So the great thing about having all these different kinds of cutting tools, nice, straight, even, sharp corners, sharp edges, straight lines, except when you mess up and, well, then you have a bench grinder. <laughs> so that gives you a little peek into the, into the cutting section of my studio. Next time, we'll talk about shaping, but right now, be trying to hit that subscribe button for me. Don't forget to come out to my website and see what I'm doing. I'll see you next time. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs>